Okay, everybody. Welcome again. This will be the final Cronus Max test video because we've now tested it on the Xbox One, the PS4, and the Xbox 360. It's time to test it on the PlayStation 3. And uh, I did mess around with my, my devices a little bit to actually get audio working, which is good. As you can hear, okay? So right now I'm not using it at all. Right now I just had the PS3 controller plugged in. I was actually charging it a little bit because I was trying to figure out an issue with my capture device, okay? Um, but I fixed it. So let's continue. The first thing we will do is we will unplug the PlayStation 3 controller from the PS3, okay? Now I'm going to plug in the Cronus Max adapter. All right, and then here, wow, this is way different. All right, everyone, so to give you some perspective, okay, here's some perspective on how different this set, this is, this is completely different from every other console we've used so far. So if you guys remember, every other console that I used, when I plugged in the Cronus Max, it blinked A and then U, right? Because that means the authentication protection is in place. Apparently there is none for the PS3 because the PS3 went straight to the next step Which is when it just kind of rotates lights and it's basically telling you it's waiting for you to plug something in So I will plug in my PS3 controller via USB just to get it to sync All right So now the Cronus Max is reading zero which means it's ready to input a different controller so what shall we try first? Why don't we try the Xbox 360 Mad Cats Arcade Fight Stick Tournament Edition S. So let's try that and see if we can, if it works. All right. And if you are noticing video freezes, that's because the HDCP bypass system that I'm using for PS3 has been having some issues lately. I have no idea how to fix those issues. So you may see the video freeze slightly from time to time. All right, so here we go. We're going to plug in the Xbox 360 uh, joystick. And it worked, but because the, X, the uh, PS3 controller was already on, okay, it turned me into player two. So basically, I'm player two right now. Um, oh, look, we have Soul Calibur Lost Swords. We can see if we can get it to work, which we probably won't. Let's see what happens here. Oh, God. Please don't take forever. Please don't take forever to install trophies. Project Sue. Watch it not work. This is what everyone says doesn't work. They all said they got the game, they tried to play, and it doesn't work. What happened? I don't even know what that was. I got a pop-up. And it sent me back here. I must have said no. Or it aired out. Hold on. Oops. Yes, I accept it. There we go. Please enter your name. go Ooh. 
Whoa. The World of Lost Swords. Select your hero of choice. Your main character can be changed later. You can either have Siegfried, right? What the fuck? He's naked. You could have naked Siegfried. You could have huge tit Sofatia in a bra. Wow, bra and underpants. She's wearing men's underwear for some reason. And you've got Mitsurugi also in his underpants. Well, I actually know how to play with Siegfried better than the other two. Although, it is kind of hard to turn down a girl in a bra. But I think we're going to start with Siegfried. What the hell? Now that I remember how to play this game or anything, it's been two years since I played a Soul Gat Caliber game. Oh, come on, it's taking too long to load. I want to test this joystick. It takes this long. Oh. Error. We apologize for the inconvenience caused with the login errors. What the hell are we looking at here? Forest of some sort. Beautiful forest. I got an AP potion and a continued ticket. Amazing. So this is going to be kick, this is going to be guard, this should be light attack, this should be heavy attack. Okay, and then the combinations do different things. Gotcha. Boom, 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 boom. Bom 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 The world of Soul Calibur and Soul Edge Ah, oh, the tutorial? Come on! Learning the basics Fighting naked Mitsurugi. Alright, naked Siegfried against naked Mitsurugi. Sounds good. How can I turn it down? Oh my god, this game takes forever to load! What is going on? Oh my god! <laughs> Come on! Play! Let me play! What the fuck? It went from a loading hourglass to a word that says now loading. Alright, finally. As the phoenix rises. No need for words. I no need for clothes. This. I speak with this giant penis. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I'm naked. I'm naked. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. 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 Beautiful. Shoulder tackle, shoulder tackle, slash that bitch. Unblockable up off. Ground, where's the ground spin? Oh, he doesn't have it. He used to have it. Press X to guard against attacks. Okay. Guard impact. I want to do it.
fight. Alright. Looking for me. Weapon R. R1 is weapon R. I don't know what button is R1 on this joystick. Shit. There it is. Whoa! Holy shit! Perfect. God damn. That was ridiculous. Found items. Press start to open up the pause menu and confirm your chests. Continue to get recovers all your HP and continues the quest without losing any of your treasure chests. Huh. Battle two. Fight. All the players can be summoned to help you on a quest. What the hell? This R2 in a partner gauge is completely full to summon your partner. Partners will be controlled with the partner until the partner gauge completely de depletes. Huh. I summoned Mitsurugi! Mitsurugi in workout pants! Damn. So you can ch tag in and out in this game. Will you fight me? Oh, she's wearing clothes. No fair. Battle. Fight. Elements of Soul Burst. Red is strong against green. Blue is strong against red. Green is strong against blue. White and black are strong against each other. Why for your fire attack and square for your what the fuck? Oh my god, I knocked the clothes off! She's butt naked! Oh my god, she's butt naked! You are well versed. Yes! We can rip their clothes off in this game. This is excellent. You see big titties. Titties! Titties! Dude, this game takes way too long to load. Alright, you gain experience and gold and shit when you win a quest. No shit. Beautiful. Alright, well. We now know that the Xbox 360 controller is working perfectly with the Cronus Max adapter. I think maybe we will switch over and try something else. I got items that you can craft into equipment. Okay. No! Do not send an ally request to him. Do not. Oh my god, this game takes way too long to fucking load. That's it, enough. Dude, enough. I'm out of here. That is not a good game to be testing anything in. It takes too fucking long. It took us 10 minutes to play the first tutorial mission. That was ridiculous, man. Alright, so. We now know that the Xbox 360 controller works with the Cronus Max. Let's now try something different. Let's try... Let's see, we already did this one. We should try the, um, the other one. The, uh, Hori Real Arcade Pro EXSE. We should try that one. <clears throat> Alright. Hold on. Switch over. Alright, so this is the Hori joystick. 
for the Xbox 360. We're trying it on PS3. Give me a moment. Somehow I managed to get the wire in a knot, even though I used it four times already tonight. How the hell did this happen? Okay, bring it over here. It's looking good. It is looking good, everybody. Yep. Works fine. Let's see. Who wants to watch Ghostbusters? We can watch Ghostbusters together. We'll test it in the PlayStation Store here. I figured the PlayStation Store is an easy place to move around menus, but not screw anything or, or boot anything, you know? So this would be a good place to move around and test these controllers. <clears throat> Alright, so. Working good. Moving around. No problems. Buttons are working. They want me to rent The Amazing Spider-Man because the sequel's coming out. The Spidey Sale. Eight bucks. Man, eight bucks to get the amazing Spider-Man? Dude, eight bucks for Spider-Man 3? You gotta pay me eight bucks to watch that fucking movie. <laughs> That's a rip right there. Alright. Alright, so... This one works. So, so far, so good. We've got the Mad Cats joystick and the Hori joystick are both working... On the PS3, even though they're Xbox 360 joysticks. Alright, let's unplug this and let's try... We'll try the PS4 and the Xbox One controllers. Alright, let's do that. Hold on. Unplug this guy. And I'll put this guy back so he's out of the way. And then we're going to try the next-gen controllers. It's actually kind of good because I actually like the uh, the Hori uh, the Hori Real Arcade Pro Stick for uh, 360 because it has the Samitsu controls which I like. Now I could use it on my PS3 if I want, which is kind of neat. Uh, okay, first we're gonna try the Xbox One controller. Let's plug that in first because that's already plugged in. So this is the Xbox. Wait a minute, this is the wrong cord. What the hell is this? Here it is. The Xbox One controller on the PS3. Does it work? Xbox One on PS3. Does it work? It's looking good. New releases. Here we go. We can see the Son of Batman. Son of Batman. What is this? <laughs> Devil's Do. Before it cut, hits Blu-ray. Now here's one I know all you want to watch. You're all chomping at the bit to see this guy. Wolf Creek 2. That's right. Before it's even in theaters, you can see Wolf Creek 2. I know you're dying to see that one. <laughs> oh my god. Terrible. Alright, so it's working. As you can see, Gambit. Labor Day. That's my favorite movie, actually. Labor Day. Bad Country, Blue Ruin, it's working. Devil's Do, it's back all, yeah, the buttons are all working. So I guess Son of Batman is, is, is featuring Damian Wayne. Was that mainstream or was that New 52 that Batman's son is, uh, is, is, uh, Damian Wayne and he becomes Nightwing? I don't know. I don't read, I don't read, I haven't read comics in a while. All right, looks good. So the Xbox One controller works. With PS3, thanks to the Cronus Max. The last one we have to test is the PS4 controller. 
So let's do that. Oh, hold on. We got that stupid video glitch going on. All right, stop. All right, the PS4 controller. Let us see if we can get this to work with the PS3. This is the last test. Here we go. Yes, the PlayStation 4 controller works on PS3. I am the stone that the builder refused, the individual, the inspiration that make the lady sing the blues. I'm the spark that makes your eyes grow bright. No, that's the wrong. I fucked it up. I'm the something something that will light the dark so that you can know your left from your right. I am the ballot in the box, the bullet in your gun, the inner glow to let you know to call your brother son, the story that what's to come, the something something something. Until the war is won. Damn it. I used to know that by heart. And I forgot most of it. Alright, anyway. I haven't seen a Boondock Season 4 yet. But anyway. It works. Look. Everything works. Archer Vice. Watch it now. Archer Vice. You should. Archer is good. Archer is an excellent show. Watch it. People in the stream chat are amazed that I knew that. Like, I, I watch, I used to watch Boondocks. I have the first three seasons on DVD. Uh, all right. So, uh, so, what are the final results of our testing? Basically, it's this. Pretty much every single controller worked on every single console using the Cronus Max. The only exception to our testing was a really old model of the Real Arcade Pro. It's called the Real Arcade Pro 3 Special Edition. That one did not work on anything. And also the Wii U Pro Controller did not work on anything. But everything else worked on everything else with the Cronus Max with really no additional input lag. So what we learned is for $60, you're going to get a device where everything works on everything. You could use... Your fucking joysticks on a next gen console, on the other current gen console it's not supposed to be for. You can use your fucking PS4 controller on the Xbox One. You could use it on the Xbox 360. You could use the Xbox One controller on the PS4 or on the PS3. Holy shit. Holy shit. It works. It is the most amazing $60 adapter I've ever purchased. I can't believe it's so... So what this is done. This has literally turned everything into a multi-platform peripheral. Now, for the most part, do I really think that it's useful to use a PS3 controller on the Xbox 360? Probably not. You know what I mean? But <clears throat> for anyone who wants to use their joysticks on another console... This just made one joystick completely multi-platform. This one device just made it so that you don't have to get dual modded sticks. You don't have to get any of that. The only, of course, the one bad thing about it is that the damn thing is banned in tournament play because it has macros in it, which is pretty nuts. So, but for the common gamer like me, you want one joystick, you work on every system, you just did. If you buy the Cronus Max, you've done it. Pretty nuts. Pretty nuts. If you put your dick in the Cronus Max, you can control any console with your balls. You squeeze them, and then it'll move through the menus. <laughs> Alright, probably not. Now. One last thing I will say in this video before I stop recording it. Today's date is April 27th, 2014. There is a chance, I don't know how big of a chance it is, but there is always a chance that both Sony and, Play and, and, Sony and PlayStation, I'm a freaking idiot, both Sony and Microsoft may patch their consoles to make this adapter not work. It's very possible they may do that. They may say, oh shit. How did this company find a way around our stuff? Well, that's not good for our intents and purposes. You know, we, we did this on, on purpose so people would have to buy the proprietary stuff to our console and therefore we're going to find a way to have a software patch and make it obsolete. 
It could happen. But as of tonight, this adapter is your absolute best bet if you want to use one controller on a different console. And again, this is a, a dream for anyone who either has PS4 or Xbox, three, uh, Xbox One. Maybe you're playing Injustice on PS4 or you're playing Killer Instinct on Xbox One and you already own a joystick from a previous generation console. You basically just buy this adapter and you're good. So there you go. All right, everyone. So that is going to be the extent of our testing of the Cronus Max adapter. I hope that you enjoyed it. I hope that you found it in very informative. You might want to check out this adapter, but I said this at the very beginning. Uh, well, actually, I, I don't actually I don't know if I did. You got to buy this from direct from the company. The company's name is Controller Max. It's the the a device name is Cronus Max. There's a ton of knockoffs out there apparently that people are trying to sell, and they're not real. So you got to be very careful, everybody. Very careful. All right. All right, that's it. Thanks for watching. And I will see you later. <clears throat>